So the capital raise. So you've talked about it. I'm not sure if you have, if you mentioned any numbers. But you said there is a capital raise coming soon. Uh, I think you said half of it was already uh, accounted for. Um, my question is, why do you think this is the best time for it? And what will it be used for? So two things. Uh, obviously, we, we probably don't need this, right? Like I, I genuinely think that once the game's out, we're, we're talking three games that are all, that all have the ability to generate revenue. The market is coming back. We're seeing a huge amount of, uh, of traction with gaming tokens. People are starting to, to flock into it again. I think we're going to look back and say, oh, we probably didn't need to do that, but it's my responsibility to make sure that we've got enough capital, ideally at least two years of, of capital, right? Like at this stage, we're sort of transitioning. We're still definitely a startup, but we're sort of transitioning into like a, a, a medium scale. And with that, I would ideally like to see us have two years of capital at all times. And again, maybe the game launches, we look back and we're like, now we've got five years of capital in the first month or two months. Why the hell did we do that? It doesn't really matter because if that situation occurs, the tokenomics are such a way that we'll be, the DAO will be buying back so much ILV that we'll fill whatever we sold, will fill that gap so quickly that it's like, it, it doesn't matter either way. What would be the situation which you can't control is if something catastrophic happened in the market or whatever, and we needed that two years of runway. And so uh, it's it's basically uh, a way for us to, to shore ourselves up. It'll make me feel better, make all, all, all the people in the team feel better. But then we're doing it differently this time. Instead of me going to uh, framework, which they've helped out a bunch with introductions and uh, and stuff like that. But instead of just getting one firm to chuck in 10 million bucks, I've looked at this and I'm like, let's make this a marketing event. Like the one thing that I that I underestimated when uh, we got that funding from Framework was how positive it made the sentiment. Right now, looking back, it's easy to say like, of course it would, right? Like if a firm like Framework does three months of DD, digs right in, then it signals something very, very positive, right? Now, that might not mean anything. Like we, we have a lot of community members that might have five grand of ILV, 10 grand of ILV. They're probably the most vocal and they were the ones who came out and said like, oh, this is ridiculous, you know, like we're, they, they sold the token so cheap and whatever. But someone who's a little bit more silent, uh, a big whale in the community, they look at that and they're like, if Framework did it, I'm in too. And we saw a huge increase in the, in the token price when nothing really had happened. And so I'm looking at that and, and obviously there's the network effects of uh, having a firm like Framework double down on you. They, they have a huge network themselves. What if we could get like six or seven or eight of these funds to go in right before we launch? That is going to be an, an even more positive thing. Yeah. And so, uh, you know, I think, again, what I'm looking for there is to, to have all of these, uh, these sort of silent whales that we have in our community to look at that and go, all right, now they're not, you know, they're, they're going to be here for another two years. If worse, like if the worst thing in the world happened, uh, they're, they're still here. And what that says to me, if I put my investor cap on, yes, it feels like it's been an, an eternity for us to build out these games. But in reality, we're building about uh, one game every 15 months. So if you then go out and say, okay, and that's brand new studio, that's including the ramp up time of our team, that's including building the IP, that's including all of the art that, that we front loaded. 
if I'm one of these big investors and all of a sudden I see, fuck, they've got two years runway again, they're at least going to get a, a, a whole nother game out before needing to generate a single drop of revenue. It's just, it's so bullish across the board and positive that it just makes sense to do.